Hi, I'm Jamal Eigel, and I'm going to draw Molly Danger for you. When I sketch, initially, I always kind of try to work very loosely just to get the general idea out. If I have a very specific idea that I want to get across, it helps to sort of broaden things. You know, I might change my mind, I might want to reposition how I want the pose to be, but it always helps me to work looser to sort of get the, the feel for the figure. Once I have the initial idea, I start to shape things. It becomes more about cylinders and spheres. One of the things that I love about drawing Molly is that she is so full of life. No matter what her circumstances in, she usually has a smile on her face. Part of Molly's costume is this oversized pink and black jacket that she wears. To me, that's sort of her cape. It allows me to create a sense of direction. One of the things that we try to do is to create the illusion of motion. And trying to remember that scale that she is under five feet tall is always tricky, especially when you're trying to place her in a scene with other characters. Molly also has giant pigtails that she wears, much like her coat. It helps add to the idea of her moving. I came up with one sketch for her design when I originally created her in 2003. After years and years of not only being around my own nieces and my own daughter, she was dressed like little girls tend to dress. They, they overdress. She's an individual. She doesn't look like any other comic book superhero. She has her own sense of style. Yeah, I remember the belt. I love the belt. My other favorite part of Molly's costume are her boots. She has these giant butt kicking boots that she wears. She thinks they make her look intimidating. My name is Jamal Eigel, and that is how you draw Molly Danger.